And this CD is exactly a compilation of like the biggest club songs on my label over the year, and uh, uh, even like the sh the songs that are coming in the next six months. So, yeah, I think the perfect combination of those like the unreleased songs and the songs people know know me for. I think that that's why we release the CD. With a million lonely people all together on this needle in the sky, afraid of heights, and your dreams were. First of all, there's a lot of people that don't attend to the festivals, maybe because they're too young or they don't have the money to attend to the festival. With the Hardball Presents Revealed uh, CDs, we always want to try to give the people a listen to all the tracks I've played out and all the new stuff that's coming. I think I was always really loyal to my fans, you know, I always try to come up with some, something new. I always try as, in my DJ sets to play like different sets as, as all the other DJs. Because a lot of other DJs out there always play like the same hits, same sets over and over again. That doesn't excite me anymore, you know. I want to come up with something new that, that I am proud of, you know. And even with my productions, I always try to come up with something new. I think every single song I've released so far is sounding different than the one before. And even as a producer, it makes it more interesting for me to you know, play my songs, otherwise my whole set will sound the same. You're an outline of a vision that you had when we were children yesterday. You watch it fade. This point in the whole EDM scene, if you talk, talk about DJs or music productions, there is more quantity than quality now. Mm -hmm. And um, I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing though, because when so many people are working on, on like new songs, you have the chance that there are even more, you know, there will be one guy again that stands up and you know comes up with something new. So I think as long as, as, as dance music is evolving and some new music styles will come up and inspire each other, that's a good thing. But yeah, at this point there are a lot of records that exactly copy each other and I think I, I, I kind of hate that. Well, definitely, I think uh, my, my DJ sets are always like exactly the music I want to play out for a crowd, the music that works on a big festival and a big stage. And with my album, I want to show the people the music I'm actually listening to. So I think it's more melodic. I think it's even there are like different, there are also non dance tracks on the album. But all, there are only tracks I really like to do. You know, as a producer, I don't have, I don't want to be caught up in one single box and you know make that own one particular style. I always mm -hmm. try to come up with different kind of styles and that's why yeah I'm working with the on the album right now in, in different genres.